So tell us, how did Uber Driver come to be? Right. Uh, well, we were getting all these new scripts in, you know, um, all kinds of new things and new ideas people were pitching. And I, I just, I got disgusted and appalled, you know, just fed up with all this new and exciting things that people wanted to push and pitch. And I thought to myself, people don't want to see something new. They want to see something that they're comfortable with, something that they've seen a thousand times before. So we went straight to the studio and uh, we came up with this idea, you know, talking to them saying, what would people really want to see a sequel to? So the first thing that came to my mind was Titanic, but they shot that down immediately. So the second thing that we thought of was Taxi Driver. So of course, you know, the next best thing we came up with was Uber Driver. I think fans are going to really like what we did with this film. We wanted to pay homage to the original, so we kept some things in. For example, Travis's classic haircut makes an appearance, although not in the way you might be expecting. But we also wanted to make this movie its own thing, you know? So, I mean, for example, in the first movie, Travis suffers from insomnia. So in this movie, we flipped it and we gave him narcolepsy. That's just one of the brilliant ideas that are in this film. Now it's with great pleasure that I introduce to you the first trailer of our future motion picture, Uber Driver. You might have heard of my father. 40 years ago, he drove a taxi. Now, I'm driving. Except taxis are dead, and Uber is king. You talking to me? USC's gonna be good this year. Are you talking to me? The coach is coming around, Sarkeesian. Yeah, I don't see anybody else in this car, so you must be talking to me. Got it, maybe. Been developing some wide receiver. Who the fuck are you talking to? Hold on one sec. But shut up, I'm trying to talk on the phone here. This is a man who would not take it anymore. The world had gone to filth, and someone had to clean it up. Oh, yeah. Hi, welcome to Wednesday. How many day? Yeah, how's it going? Uh, can I get a uh, Baconator meal? Uh, can I get two Frosties? And uh, you guys serve tacos here? Hey man, you know you're still on the clock, right? And then I saw her. The woman of my dream. I saw you. I thought you were the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Thank you. What are you doing out here anyway? I'm just trying to get people to come out for the next election. What candidate are you supporting? Oh, Donald Trump! Um... Some girls are just too crazy. Even for me. Hey man, wake up! Oh, sorry man. Just my narcolepsy. They let people with narcolepsy drive for Uber. Oh yeah man. Uber will take anybody with a license. That's why I tell all my friends with felonies to apply online. So this is my first time using Uber. How does it work exactly? It's like taxis, but way cheaper. And let me tell you what. All the drivers are very professional. We keep our cars very clean. What is this doing back here? Oh, gee, hey, put that back. I have back problems. One way or another, I always get five stars. The way I see it, you've got two choices right now. You can stop fighting over the fair, or we can have an unfair fight. Why is your pubic hair in the style of a mohawk? Well, I hope you guys enjoyed our trailer of Uber Driver. We done here? That was good, guys. Let's uh let's do that again after the Oscars. <laughs>